What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Alex's Toy Show. Who just saw the Royal Rumble and has two thumbs? All right, well, oh, there's half of the thumb. This guy! Yep, I was, uh, while Grim was uh, living it up in sunny Florida, at the Royal Rumble, me, uh, Attack Slug, and the Ninja Twins were watching, you know, at home. And, uh, it, I, you know, for all that happened, I have to say I am not disappointed. So, uh, clearly we have a new WWE champion. His name is Triple H. Kind of no surprise there. I didn't think, I don't know, like I had said in my, uh, picks video that I didn't know how they were going to do it, how Roman Reigns was going to go through the end. The answer is he didn't. <laughs> he, um, you, you know, the one part that I didn't like about that, and I have to, I have to get it out there, is that, um, the, uh, the Nation of Domination there, uh, Sheamus and, uh, Alberto Del Rio and Rusev, they came out early in the Rumble after Rusev was eliminated. Oh, yeah, what's up with that, right? He comes out number two and they just tosses him right out almost? That was way lame. Way lame. So anyway, the three of them come out, uh, with Vince McMahon to ringside and they drag, um, they drag Roman Reigns out through the ropes. Through the ropes, not over the ropes. They just pull him out. They beat the crap out of him. The stretcher comes along and takes Roman Reigns backstage. And, you know, and he's gone for, like, a good portion of the Rumble. And then he comes out at the end. Like, uh, let's see. Sheamus came out number 29. And Roman Reigns came running down, knocks Sheamus out. And he gets back in the ring. And he starts punching people out. The crowd started booing him. Now listen, if you're Triple H and you're going to come in number 30 and then you're going to win the title off of Roman Reigns, leave him in the match. Make him look strong. Have him in there the whole time. But you know what it was? is They had to get him out of the ring so that there was no interference uh, between Brock and the Wyatts and Roman Reigns. Like, that would have just been utter chaos, you know? And So I, I get the reason why they took him out of the ring. It's just... None of it was going to work. Uh... Some cool things, though. Uh, we saw Sami Zayn, right? Came out for a little bit. Now, I don't... Is it a push to the roster, the main roster? No. Sami Zayn has some stuff going on in NXT still. I don't think he's going to be up at the main roster, at least not until after all that stuff in NXT is done. We saw AJ Styles. I said it was not out of the question. His contract was up Saturday. It would not be unreasonable to fly him out for the Royal Rumble, and sure enough, they did. Got him right in there at number three. They left him in there a little while, made him look good. I love it. I love it. Now, I didn't realize, like, I saw pictures of him, and I, I thought he looked uh, taller, taller and, and bigger, but he's actually, like, on the shorter side. Uh, no problem. Just just a surprise, because i never seen him in action before. Uh, what else was pretty good? How about our truth Comes out, digs up the ladder, and he climbs to the top of the ladder in the center of the ring, and he's like, where's the title? Get the fuck out of here, Truth. And, um, who was, uh, who, who was quickest in and out? I think, um, uh, not Mark Henry, but, uh, ah, oh, shit, what is his name? Jack Swagger. Comes running right in. Brock Lesnar is like, nah, -uh, and throws him right back out. Oh, so anyway, so that was the Royal Rumble. Uh, the individual matches, I was surprised. I was very surprised to see Kevin Owens and Dean Ambrose, um, in the Royal Rumble after they go the whole last man standing because they dished out a brutal beating to each other. Dean Ambrose won that. Uh, I really thought Kevin Owens was going to take that match. And I thought Alberto Del Rio would defend over Kalisto, but Kalisto won. So I got that back uh, mixed up. Uh, tag titles, I kind of call that. New Day is so over. There's no reason to, to take them uh, out of the title picture. And and who are you going to give it to? The, the Usos who have been tag champs already? I, I think it's better to keep the feud going as they have been doing it. Um, that's not too bad. And and I thought I thought all of the New Day was going to be in the Rumble, but I like that they only used Xavier because uh, not Xavier. I'm sorry, uh, Kofi. Um, but even though Co Kofi wrestled, so it was that was that was what was puzzled to me was they were coming out. And I didn't see Kofi's name up top at first. Uh, they were coming out, and it looked like Xavier was, you know, getting into the ring, and then Kofi gets in there. And I'm like, oh, well, that's weird. So you're just wasting Xavier to be ringside for two matches? Whatever. And then uh, Del Rio was in, the, was in the Rumble, but not Kalisto, so what the hell is that? And then uh, who, do, who am I missing? Oh, 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 Charlotte and Becky Lynch. So, so here's what it is. Charlotte won it. Uh, it was... 
more interference by Ric Flair. And oh, who saw Ric Flair kiss, kiss Becky Lynch on the mouth? Oh, I hope she doesn't have like, like mouth disease or anything. I hope she gets some like scope and just washes that shit out. Uh, and then, and then, and then, and then. Now I thought, I thought there was a little more injury to uh, Sasha Banks than was led on because she came out and she's like, oh, the shit has hit the fan because Sasha Banks, she gets in the ring and, and she goes, you know, she's like, hey, what's up, Charlotte? And then she goes and beats the crap out of Becky Lynch. Not to say that Becky Lynch, you know, took an insult to injury already. Poor, I feel bad for Becky Lynch. I, I thought, you know, I thought she put up a good match. She lost by Ric Flair cheating and interfering. She, th- you know, he threw his jacket over her head while, you know, she had the arm lock on. And I'm like, come on. Can't you ban this motherfucker from the ring? So hopefully we see a rematch of some sort. I don't think it's going to happen. But but now now maybe we'll see a triple threat or it's just going to be one-on-one Sasha Banks and uh, the female Ric Flair. <laughs> she needs to do some squats, man. She's got no ass. Charlotte, if you're listening, do some squats. Take a look. Take a look at Sasha's ass. That is amazing. That's what you need to look your ass like. I mean, I'm just saying. You, you're like a board. <laughs> Whatever, right? All right, guys. Let me know how you like the rumble. Leave your comments in the comments. <laughs> There's that humor I was telling you about. Uh, I want to hear what you think about the rumble. Um, and we'll talk about it. Like this video. Leave me a comment. And subscribe for more.